Hello friend, I am Alex. Today I am talking about the web server. Web server basically platform to fetch your data on globally. Now today I am talking about the WHM panel. WHM panel basically a graphical user interface where we can manage all the things on globally. So before starting it, I am just logging to my server via this credential just I am going to here. Just meant hold on one minute. Okay, this is my server. So before uh, installing any whole package on the system, I type the command yum update hyphen y. This is command used to install all the basic package on your system, just like I am using here CentOS. So this will take uh, time one to three minute so okay at that moment I will hold the video when it is completed I will come back okay now it is completed and uh, after that uh, it is need that your host name to associate your IP address so I check host name so this is the given host dot unix server dot tk and this is my IP address if config command and now I enter into the file etc host dot Yes. Okay, and this is this some entry by default uh, and loop pack address and IPv6 as well as IPv4. Then I add my host name as well as my IP host .unix service tk and uh, I have to save this file. Okay, now so there is a one more file. There is a host name entry exit sysconfig uh, network file and enter and create add this file with host name equals to host dot unix service dot tk okay I will save this file and okay I have uh, also updated my all the documentation in test file where I can install the whm panel so I log into the test file this is the script that is to use to install whm panel or send to server i run this service okay this package is installed the script is installed on server so i again type the oh yeah and let us yeah, it is uh, download now sh that is the script name so the default script is run it uh, install all the WMCS package which is need to module okay I see the error here network manages install to running okay because CentOS use their own networking setting so we have to uh, enable the setting for WHM panels so first of all I disable this internet setting by this command so this symbolic link has deleted and I also stop this network manager utility I again the type command okay so I again for, after that I remove the log file which is created during the installation okay now I again install this script by this command okay this is taking this some time because if you install this uh, script on your local system it will take uh, more than three hours if you install okay this is installed now now I have to the login to the system by my oh this is my IP address now I have to the login to the system with the IP address and the port 2086 IWHM port okay now this is login advanced setting and I will login the install the browser certificate I type the username and the password ok I am just successfully login it will take a few seconds to login on the system ok there is the uh, sum of uh, basic setting to a geographical environment so I enter so first of all I enter the email address server contact email address so I type any name uh, in abc at the gmail.com I type any of the mail address 
now this is the my server host name and this is the dns setting primary secondary again next option so this is the server ip address and this is the different different package of binding services bind power dns my dns so we will prefer bind service to install name service so this is the my name server and this is associated with ip i check uh, mark and go to the next step so this is the name server has been installed on my system for all the uh, domain which is hosted on my system it will take the default name server ns1 unix service dot tk ns1 ns2 unix service dot tk if i want to change these default name server to particular customized according to the domain then we have to update this thing in edit file in dns zone okay is uh, again another service ftp so we have uh, installed default ftp service pure ftp and save this file and go to the next step so this service is installed so i wait for some moment here okay i finish this documentation of installation and this is the last step okay i go to whm panel so uh, this is the last some utility has to be installed and have the save setting on the system so i have to fill up the all the requirement of whm panel okay now i come back to the panel in a few minutes this is the panel and there is the different different option to configure to manage all the utility so basically the here we have how to install wj panel or centos 7 and the please like this video share this video and subscribe it if you need more technical video please uh, comment my video and subscribe your query